Mistress Farragonda has been saved thanks to the tears of the Black Willow and Flora sacrificing herself for her sister Mio discovers the Enchantix power. Very interesting. Hmm. Wowee! Hey! What is going on? This was bound to happen sooner or later. It's the Omega Portal. It stayed open so long that all the negative energy that leaked out of the dimension is causing the entire world to collapse in on itself. What will happen to Andros, then? Have a look for yourself. Andros and the Omega Dimension are connected through the portal, so if one dimension is destroyed, the other will inevitably be destroyed along with it. Master Saladin, what could be so important that you simply had to pay me a visit in the middle of the night? Miss Farragonda, we've just learned that Andros is in grave danger. If the Omega Portal is not shut as soon as possible, the planet won't survive. <gasps> this is terrible. Is it Valtor's work? Only indirectly, in that it was his dark spell that first opened the passage between the two worlds. The fact that it was never fully closed is what has led to this terrible crisis. I'd better wake Layla and the girls. What in the world could be so important that my beautiful dream had to be interrupted? What was your dream about, Stella? Brandon had his own wings, and we were flying to his mansion up in the clouds. Forget that. In my dream, I converted a mansion into a state-of-the-art recording studio. <gasps> no! Layla! What's wrong? My parents, I can't let them down. Miss Vergonda, I am the Princess of Andros. I have to go home. I can't let you go alone. It's too dangerous. No need to ask. We'll go with you. You can always count on us. We're here for you, all of us. All right, girls, but you be careful. Don't take unnecessary risks. Saladin says the situation on the ground is deteriorating very quickly. Okay, I'm almost done. Here goes. The dimensional passage to Andros is now accepting passengers. Thanks, Tecna. You're so brilliant. Tell 
Tell me what will become of our kingdom. <gasps> Let's go back in. It's too dangerous out here. Your Majesty, more monsters are coming out of the portal! And the Guardian mermaids can't stop them. No! Don't worry, <gasps> we'll deal with that. <laughs> Layla, sweetheart, no. Why did you come all the way here? Huh? Daughter, there's nothing that can save Andros now. I can't believe you, Dad. How can you say something like that? I'm sorry to be so negative, but I'm afraid none of this can be stopped. Never give up hope, Daddy. Layla. Don't be stubborn. Go back to Elfia, please. I can't risk losing you. I'll go back, Dad, right after all of us fighting side by side close the Omega portal and set our planet free. You heard her, girls. Let's do it. Magic, we wait! We girls are the witch. Energy created. Our magic power. We're the witch. Enchanted. Enchanted. Go ahead, Layla. I'll join you soon. We'll save Andros together. I'm counting on you, Daddy. will soon be a thing of the past. Doesn't it bother you to know that your lair will also be destroyed? She's got a point! Huh. And we can't forget about the mermaids you transformed. They've been valuable minions. Who knows, we might need them again before this is over and done with. I always assumed that the mermaids wouldn't survive past stage one. What? what? Hey, why so shocked? I've already gotten hold of Andros's most powerful magic formulas, and I can perform all their spells perfectly. So what more can I get from this miserable planet? Zilch, absolutely nothing. <gasps> Look, it's the Winx. <laughs> Tecna, any suggestions? Yes, virtual shield. even catch our breath. They keep coming. I know. It's as if there's an endless supply of these horrible creatures. One monster zero. Yeah. Ah, ah! Stella, no, fairy dust.
How's it going? Oh. Hey, Layla, there's the portal. I just hope it's not too late. like the winks are well and truly done for. Yeah, I feel kind of bad. Come on, Darcy, have you lost your mind? Not at all. It's just that I always thought we would be the ones who would get to destroy them in the end. I mean, I don't know, after all the battles we fought against the winks. Um, well, yeah, I agree. It does seem kind of like we're getting gypped on this deal. Yeah, it doesn't seem right, does it? Let's go. Hold on a second. Where do you think you're going? Veltor. Why do you want to stop us? I thought you hated the Winks as much as we do. Those fairies have almost no chance of survival. The portal is going to give way any minute now, and the Winks, along with the entire dimension, will go spinning into oblivion. So, let me ask you this. Why do you want to share their fate? <laughs> Quick! Don't let it get away! Yes, your majesty! <gasps> Layla, sweetheart. Are you all right? Dad, it's so good to see you. Oh, you saved my life. <laughs> no, Layla, I, I think it's you who saved me. You gave me the strength to believe and to keep hoping. I'm very proud of you, sweetheart. Oh, Dad, I love you. Your Majesty, they're attacking us! Dad, if you can keep them busy, I'll try to get closer to the portal and see if I can find a way to seal it. It's too dangerous. If you get too close to the funnel, you could get sucked in, and then you'd be gone forever. But it's our only hope. I have to try. Wait a while. Not yet. Tabok the Wise is on his way. Andros's greatest wizard will know what to do. Meanwhile, let's deal with the monsters. Can you free those poor mermaids from Valtor's spell? With my fairy dust, I think so. Good. Then I will lure them in for you. Guards, fan out in all directions and give the princess some space. For Andros! Broken. Well done, sweetheart. Now I must rejoin my soldiers. You wait here for Tabok the Wise. Oh, thank you, princess. That spell was a pure living nightmare. Way to go, Layla! Oh. Girls, Tabok, we were waiting for you. His ship was destroyed by Valtor's mermaids. So we gave him a ride, just in time. Without your friends, I would not have made it. It's very good to see you again, Princess. Huh? There are more monsters over there! Ocean of Light! Smash hit! Okay, we'll take care of the monsters. You deal with the portal. Stop here. It's too risky to get any closer. Tabak, what's wrong? I... I am partially to blame for this. A long time ago, I helped to build this portal. In order to make it escape-proof, we designed it so it could not be opened or closed. It was to be a fail-safe defense against the greatest of evils. But 
Obviously, we underestimated Valtor's power. Hmm. Well then, Tebok, why not forget about closing the portal and try destroying it instead? These ancient scrolls contain enough magic to do just that, but I'll also need your help. What do you want us to do, Tebok? I need you to converge all of your magic onto the scrolls. All of our magic? Okay, we'll do it. This is our one and only hope. <sighs> Created by the great wizards of the first triumvirate of Andros, this portal will be no more. By the power of Medak, the highest wizard in the realm of... <laughs> are gone. Tebok, what do we do now? The funnel is growing stronger. We must leave the planet immediately. What? We can't leave now. There's got to be something else we can do. <sighs> I'm afraid the portal is completely out of control. The only way to close it now is from the inside. To achieve that would require more courage and power than anyone has. Our only real option is to leave the planet. I'm not going to let another planet be destroyed. I couldn't do anything about Domino, but I can surely try to save Andros. Bloom, it's my responsibility to save my world. Well then, we'll do it together. Wait, I can do it. Hey, look! Tecna, what are you doing? Tecna! No, she cannot risk her life for my planet! Tecna, no! You are needed here, Layla, to help rebuild. What Tecna is doing takes great courage. We must allow her to live out her destiny.
have to do something. We have to save her. Uh, I'm so sorry. Tecna has sealed herself away inside a locked and frozen dimension. There's nothing more we can do for her. Tecna is gone. <laughs> I must admit, those fairies sure love to sacrifice themselves. Good thing, because they'll soon have to do a lot more sacrificing. Ooh, I can't wait. With one Winx less to deal with, finishing them off will be a cinch. Tecna's sacrifice has saved the kingdom of Andros, but has granted Valtor his best victory. Without Tecna, the Winx Club makes no more sense. And for the fairies, the time will come for the most difficult resolution. You're a Winx, there's a place for you Meet a thousand friends to share your dreams and faith If you're a Winx, you can never lose If you trust your heart